welcome to X Factor presented by Xfinity. I'm Tori Petri joined by TJ Lang. TJ, are those toothbrushes? They are toothbrushes. Uh, just a friendly reminder, you know, good, good hygiene is always a good way to start the day. And, uh, you know, Lions, hey, making a lot of silly plays last couple losses. You know, good little prop too to remind them to you know to clean it up a little bit. You know, might have to scrub out a win this week too. We can keep going. We can keep going with the cliches. But yes. Okay, the toothbrush puns are just too much. Let's see how the Lions can clean it up this week against the Washington Football Team. Who is going to be their X factor that needs to play well? I'm going with the rookie running back DeAndre Swift. I think you know we've seen him the last couple of weeks getting starting to get a little more and more touches. Nine carries the last week, nine carries the week before. And then this past week he comes out and they get him the ball 16 times. I think he is uh, obviously a dynamic playmaker when he gets the ball in his hands. A uh, couple of really nice runs last week, starting with this one early in the first quarter, kind of a tone setter, little breakdown on the right side of the line, but that's okay. I want the thing I want to focus on though is how fast and how quick he's getting through the line of scrimmage. There's a lot of times when we see uh, Swift and the other running backs maybe hesitate a little bit stutter and that, often leads to maybe those one or two yard gains when he hits the hole like this a lot like uh, some of the other guys around the league they hit the hole and they go forward as fast as they can the Washington defense I know they've got a lot of playmakers especially on the defensive side of the ball but uh, they're they're still allowing over you know almost 130 yards a game uh, on the ground so I look for this to kind of be one of those rough and tumble uh, go get three, four, five yards, and then look for Swift to cop, pop a couple big ones throughout the game. Uh, I think it's going to be a heavy run play action day for the Lions offense. All right. Now, who is the X factor on the Washington football team that the Lions need to stop? Terry McLaurin. I th he, he's definitely a guy that uh, he's, he's their stud on the offense. He's their playmaker. He's got so far halfway through the season, he's on pace for over a hundred catches and, and uh, you know, 1400 yards. He's, he hasn't gotten in the end zone a whole lot, but he has the last two games. You look at this play last week uh, against the giants. It's, it's nothing pretty. He goes on a crossing route, uh, battles, catches the ball, but obviously terrible tackling by the New York giants defense, but the breakaway speed, Last week, he had this 68-yard catch that got him back into the game. Week before that, he had a 52-yard touchdown catch. Um, so he's kind of their big play guy uh, that they look for. He's got 77 targets on the on the year. I think their next best as far as in the passing game is J.D. McKissick, I think has 47 targets. So obviously a, pick, a big discrepancy there. They know they're going to try to get the ball to, to Terry McLaurin when they need to make a big play. Uh, this is a good team in, in Washington. They're a physical team. They're a tough team. Um, a lot of similar characteristics to what you have, but this is a good week to kind of get back on track if you're Detroit. All right, good stuff, TJ. The Lions head into the second half of their season with that game against Washington football team this weekend. Thank you so much, TJ. We'll see you next week. Thank you guys for joining us on X Factor presented by Xfinity.